Hi guys, Postman's Bin, so we'll have a quick post bag video. I think at least one or two of these are connectors, the batteries. And that one, oh, that feels like uh, nozzles for the 3D printer. <laughs> right. Okay. So that's connectors for me. Batteries. Actually, I have a little project I want to do with them. And they should be similar in here, but a different size. Okay, so we need to check whether those are actually the right size. Have a look in a minute. And this, a big bag for just a little bag of little bag of brass nozzles. <laughs> Nothing else in there. Are they loose in there or are they in another bag? Come on, can't even get it open. There we go. Right. Okay, so that should be, what's that, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, yeah, probably 20. <clears throat> Had a bag like that when I first bought the 3D printer and I've worked my way through all of them. Well, I think I've got about one left. Oh, hang on, what size is that nozzle? Well, that might be right. Should be, um, well, it's not even written on the side. These are cheap ones. Oh, that one's written on it. 0 0.4. Yeah, they have got 0 0.4 written on them. Oh, that's okay. Right, you may have seen the video where I modified the camera off my SEMA drone to have a button on it so you could switch it on and off. And then I put that on a kite. It was okay, but not quite as good as I wanted. So I designed a different bracket for the kite. This is my other SEMA camera, which I haven't modified, which is what these are for. So we want to see if that will fit on there, which it looks like it does. So it looks like we got the right one. I wasn't sure, but I took a chance. So that looks like that's the right one. So this time, rather than modifying the camera and putting a button on it, I'm going to use one of these. One of these, and connect them together via an external button in that hole there, and then have the battery on there. So we can actually use a non-modified camera. I can still use that one, but I just thought it'd be nice if we could do it without having to modify the camera, if anybody wanted to copy what I was doing. So there we go. 
so thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe leave us a comment so I know how I'm doing and somewhere up here there'll be some links to related playlists thanks again <laughs>